fire caused part of I-5 to be shut down for miles as it tripled in size in less than a day. Yeah, back in July when we were having decent weather, you know, we were getting ready for most of our events. Um, we always have the Brewfest in August, and we have certain events that take place in town in July. And uh, on July 23rd is when the car fire started. Um, we were seeing more and more smoke. Uh, as it increased, it got worse. Uh, then the her fire started right after that, and that was in August. That got going pretty well, and about mid-August is when the Delta fire started. And so the three fires combined over 229,000 acres, thousands of homes that were burned, really impacted Dunsmere. The first day we were allowed to come back, it was, um, it was heart-wrenching. It made it uh, really difficult to see people that had, um, I kind of had to suffer through this for 45, 50 days. It was hard to see a small town like this go through that. The big relief was when the fires did get under control and the weather started to clear up. Uh, that's when we noticed that, gee, people started to come back. We want to invite people to come back up to Dunsmere and uh, enjoy our restaurants. Enjoy our new hotels and our hotels that we have. Our unique shops. And our beautiful natural surroundings. Our rivers are flowing full. Uh, we have fish in the river, so it's ready to be fished.
Dunsmuir's Nightlife. Ha, 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 ha.